Yo, top of the morning, y'all. What's going on? It's your boy, Sinister. I hope everybody feeling good, feeling great, feeling blessed, working hard to be successful. All right, if you're new to the channel, we got some business we need to handle. Be sure that you hit that subscribe button right here. Hit it. Tap it. Press it. No, you got to press it harder than that. Push it. I, 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 it changed. It says subscribe. All right, for sure, for sure. All right, listen, I'm just making sure you subscribe. That's it. You know, we got to get the subscriptions up. We got to get these thumbs up, you know, and make sure that you hit that little notification bell um, so you be notified when I drop brand new videos. All right, y'all. So, top of the morning. Today, let me mark what today is. Today is December 11th. And I'm over here at Juliet Cold Storage, Illinois, uh, ah, over here in Illinois. So we go in, we got two part delivery. The first part is going to be North Platte, Nebraska. Then we're going to Cheyenne, Wyoming, Walmart. Now, the best part about this load is two parts. And I'm going to do this video because I remember somebody was asking me to do a video on the paperwork so they can understand the paperwork out here. So I was like, you know what? Let me start doing that. So, as you can see, I have two separate pieces of paperwork. So, the first part of the paperwork is Nebraska. And it's 20 pallets that's coming off at the Walmart there. And you'll see it right here. 20 pallets. This is. And then you look, you don't don't look at the net weight. Look at the gross weight. So 18,345 uh pounds. You use that. Don't use the net. But also on here, the net is the same also. So um I always go by the gross because sometimes the net be off but it's dead on this time so okay um let me see product code right here I guess it contains these um Rose Original Recipe Mini Subs. I guess that's what that is. Um, your seal number is right here. And that's when you get out and you go check the seal. This is where it's going. Right here. This is the time the paperwork got printed. This is the time I checked in yesterday. So I could try to get the, the detention. Um... Your temperature is right here. Trailer. So, um, that's how it looks. Ain't too much. And it's the same for the second page. It's just less pallets. The second, the Wyoming, uh, Cheyenne, Wyoming has eight pallets coming off and the rest of the weight is going to be 5,328 pounds so it's going to be a very light load going out out west so um it's going to a Sam's Club and that's it that that's it. I don't have to punch nothing in. Some of y'all, when you go to make a carriers, you got to punch that stuff in your Qualcomm or your, um, what is the other thing I had at night? Uh, Zonar or People's Net. You probably have to send the total weight, pallet pieces. Like, if I call C.H. Robinson, because it's a C.H. Robinson load, if I call C.H. Robinson, C.H. Robinson asked me the pallet count, what's the weight, 
Is it a 53 foot trailer? Is it swinging doors? What's the temperature set at? And yeah, 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 and all that. Um, so, um, I already did my pre trip before I did this video. I gotta put my sweater on. It's kind of nippy. It's nippy up here. So, I'm gonna, well, you know what? Let me see something. So, calculator. So, since it's 18,345 pounds and then 5,328, it's only 23,673 pounds heavy. So, I don't gotta scale it, I can roll with it because. Anything under 35,000, you really don't have to scale. Um, but if you want to scale it, you can. If you don't want to scale it, you ain't got to. So, um, that's it. Now, let me see. It has to be delivered. Let me see. The first delivery, where's my phone? Um, here we go. So I got a seven o'clock appointment for tomorrow, which is November, uh, December 12th, for 1900 hours, which is seven o'clock evening. That's just military time. Because that's what they use out here. Military time. Um, so. And then I have to be. In. Cheyenne, Wyoming. For. December 13th. For a 4 o'clock. Which is 1600. Appointment. Which is four o'clock in the afternoon, and um, we going out west. I said I don't usually go out west, but they gave me this, and I was like, "Hey, you know what? I run with it." You know, I got some goals I'm trying to get done, and then remember, I just came out from home time, so um, trying to just get some things stacked up, get ready for. The new year plus, you know, loads just started picking up. Um, Got to take it and run with it. Got to take it and run with it. Um, it's going to be very good on fuel. Yesterday, I got some fuel. So, this receipt is horrible. God. I have to use the yellow. Alright, so I got 127.67 gallons. I caught it at a speedway for $3.05. So I spent $390.54 so far. So let me grab my stapler. And um I'm at half a tank. So, I already know I'm going to have to get some more fuel and everything like that. And I got to, okay, so this is the first, the first fuel receipt, I believe, for the week. Let me check. Okay, here's some fuel right here, the fifth. Now, this was last week's. So, what I do is. I got me a little notepad where, you know, I keep track of my fuel expense for the week. Because like I said, I try to aim for at least $1,200 for the week. Nothing more, nothing less. Well, nothing more, anything else, less is beneficial. So... Um, I'll put the, I'll put the date, which was 12, 10, 18, and then I'll put 
$390.54. And stick my receipt in there like that. And just sit it on the floor. So, as I'm going and I'm doing this trip and for the week, like, I know everybody probably do it a certain amount of fuel for the trip. Um, I do it for the total gross of the week. And it works out. It works out for me. So, um, I'm going to get rolling. And go stop at a truck stop, give me some coffee. And boogie out. You know what I mean? Boogie out. Just wanted to get a video done today. I hope that helped a lot of y'all out that wanted to know about the paperwork and how that works out. And um, I'll holla at y'all on the next video. I try to. I'm gonna try to get some um, driving footage while I'm out west with the GoPro. So um, I usually just have it mounted up here. Recording out the window and stuff like that. So, but hey, if y'all like this video, be sure to hit that thumbs up. If you caught this video late, be sure that you hit the subscribe button. And down in the description box down below is my other social media sites. If you want to follow me on any of my other social media sites, come follow me and I'll holla at y'all later. Peace out, y'all. Later.